the school-to-prison pipeline. It's a term that describes how American kids get pushed out of public schools and into the juvenile and criminal justice systems. Basically, harsh zero-tolerance policies in schools have led to more suspensions, expulsions, and even in-school arrests. Getting suspended or expelled means more time away from school, and it doesn't take an honor student to figure out that's bad news. In fact, expelled and suspended students are more likely to get held back a grade, end up in juvie, or just drop out altogether. And dropping out of high school makes you three times more likely to get arrested. Back in school, forget about hallway monitors. Students these days often have to deal with school police. Minor offenses that might have landed you in the principal's office back in the day can now actually lead to your arrest. Students of color and those with disabilities are disproportionately affected. Black students get expelled three times more than their white classmates, while a student with a disability is two times more likely to get an out-of-school suspension than everyone else. And it's not because these kids are just bad apples. The Justice Department found that black students got harsher punishments than their white peers for doing the same things. So maybe it's time our education system got schooled?